Hello everyone and welcome back to Lokir. And we're gonna keep burning our way through Bretonia. Lokir is burning through the south while our gal in the north is burning through Corone. We are taking a little bit of a break right now to recruit some black guards though. And I think I actually want a couple more units because I do want a couple of cold one nights just to get that anti-large cab. Because we are fighting a lot of cab in Bretonia. So let's get rid of one of each of these and just grab a bunch of those. I think that's going to be nice. Oh, they're taking Helmgard. I mean... Oh, wait, that's Rapons. I was, I was going to say, do they even take this? But with Rapons, yeah, definitely. Just let them have it. It's fine. The Curse of Kurnos. A curse is befalling the local forest. One of your lords has begged for the help of Kurnos, a god of the hunt, in order to track down some slaves that have escaped from his estate. However, he neglected to carry out the required sacrifice first. Heretic! Burn him! Or her, I guess. I thought it said him. Did he not? Did I? Yeah, he neglected. Well, that doesn't seem entirely right. <laughs> Uh, what is your loyalty? You are 100% loyal, so that's fine. So we can get some arrows of Kernos for the cost of a little bit of loyalty, but you're gonna be fine. Or we get some experience for the cost of, well, money. I think Wrath of Kernos is kinda nice. The Missile Strength does nothing though, but getting some arrows of Kernos is pretty good. We're gonna slay his family. There we go. And just like that, the... Uh, the uh, wild hunt started. That makes sense. Dark so I don't think we have. Uh, I guess. I guess these guys do have um, hand crossbows. So I guess we give it to this guy. He does have chill blade, but I like him to have that instead. And we'll Tyrants give. Who wants the shield blade? Powerful enchantress. You're level 13. When do you get your black dragon? Oh, okay, 22, so never. <laughs> uh, we'll just give you the chill blade, I think. And I guess we have a bunch of level ups to do, so let's grab Earthing. Let's. Ooh, Rune of Cain. That's. Oh, you got loads of level. Um, Impassion is fine. Line breaker. Oh man, there's just a lot to level. Um, you level automatically from now on. You can just have tested for the health. Sadistic is nice to have. And oh, I guess we're still doing that. Oh, actually, in that case, grab the hero killing blow. And I just like the rune of Cain, I think. That is a lot of melee attack though. That's nice. I like it. And I guess you level too. Sweet. Keep grabbing good stats. Ooh, Martial Name of Power is excellent. And uh, yeah, Above Suspicion is fine. And right, you need that still. And you can finally start getting Line Breaker. Finally. So, the name of power, the teacher. We can get Spite Heart to lower those cooldowns pretty nicely, but... Oh yeah, Bloodlust is sweet. And that's a lot of charge bonus. Yeah, let's, let's grab that charge bonus. That's pretty nice. So, you need to keep moving. You'll be there soon enough. You're taking a lot of attrition, but that's gotta be fine. Oh, hell. Hello. <laughs> You're, you're working hard, I see. And you're working hard, I see. Because you're on your way to our stuff. And we're still pretty healthy. So I want to go to Aquatine, but we can go through like a lot of these things and just burn them on the way. So let's start with you. Yeah, we can order resolve that. Let's sack it, and I think we can still, yeah, we can still get there. That's fine. Sit in there and pretty much recover the full, except for the black dragon. 
which is recovering very slowly and doesn't enjoy my auto resolves, I guess. That's all right. My lady will not allow it. And I'm not too worried about these. As, as, so, as long as we get these, we're gonna be all right. And I guess that's all of them. Do have Boris coming on in over here? But he's gonna move, and we should. Yes. Oh, we don't really get there in time, though. That's okay. If we think he can reach us and kill us, we might need to move like over here, but then we can meet up with this guy the turn after. So I think that's gonna be all right. And Lewin is going for Brookwater. This is in a settlement. Could we win this? There's a lot of cav in there. I guess Lewin is kind of scary. We might be able to win this. It is going to be pretty hard for them to use their their cav effectively here. And I think if you just hold this and maybe this, with, which we should be able to do with not that many units, I think we're going to be alright. And we're... Oh, that's a lot of stuff. And I guess the rest is over there. You know what? Yeah. I think we got this. I think this is going to be okay. So, let's uh, set up some spares over there. We'll set up some spares over there. Set up some of these like there and there. They'll hold that. And then we need to hold this. Which we can do with you. And kinda you, I think. And we'll move these guys around where we think there's gonna be the worst of it. So they're gonna kinda gonna be like a hit squad. Set up some of these. They do have flying stuff, but that's gonna be fine. And let's actually do like that and that. You'll hang out there. Oh wait, you're at group three. You'll go where you're needed. And you'll go where you are needed. And we're gonna hold this. So question is, which tower do we build? Could just build it over here. But he's not very good at shooting this and this. Where are your towers? It's over there. That's that's a terrible tower placement. And over there. Okay, that's absolutely terrible. We do have some others here, right? Okay, you know what? I guess we're building over here. It's gonna be fine. So, let's see how this goes. Um, we do have Shadows of Anlik, and we can sacrifice some slaves if we need to, but for now, we're just gonna let them move on in on us. Oh, they're trying to shoot... Oh, they're trying to shoot the paladin. Um, dodge. Ow. Ow. That hurt. <laughs> hurt quite a bit. Oh, shit. It, it did it twice. <laughs> you bastard. All right. Well, grab both of you. Shoot at these guys. And they're going in here. So let's send in those guys. Move up a little bit. Try not to be shot by that too much. And yeah, we're just going to... We're just gonna cut through this guy. So turn you around, turn you around. Let's pop the slaves. It's gonna be good. We got some mounted yeomen coming on in. Oh, well, that's fine. Send in the black guards. Uh, that's gonna be fine. Oh, hello. Okay, well you're gonna go down quick. You're going down pretty quick. And we got a lot of shooting into the... What the hell are you shooting? Okay, well, the Black Guard is taking down this this damsel really quickly. Okay, you stop that. Uh, can you just shoot over there instead? That would be very nice. Okay, you can shoot that perfectly. Okay, excellent. 
Okay, try to do a little bit extra damage so she doesn't come back. Yeah, okay, she's in the air. Send you over there. The paladin is pretty much dead. These guys haven't gotten to us yet, so that's fine. In that case, send in the Dread Knights. And I think it's time for our first Shadow of Amlek. It's pretty good damage. It's pretty good damage. And the Dread Knights are so damn cool. I really like the... I, I always like the... The, like, Dino Cab. I always fi find them really cool. Oh, we got Luin in there. Oh, and a Paladin in the Executioners. Well, let's turn you around, turn you around. And let's try to get an angle with these guys. Let's see if we can shoot anything here. I guess we can put you over there. Because they don't seem to be attacking much from this side. So, yeah, get you behind here. Prop that up. We are winning it. Very thoroughly over there. That's nice. We just keep pushing in there. And if they're running, we just uh, we just reform and fall back. Because they are attacking into us. There's no need to go and fight them where they want us to fight. That's gonna be good. You are very done. So let's send in the... Oh, hello. Let's kill these questing knights. And honestly, I don't think we need to guard that, so... Let's just sit you here, see if we can get some shots. Just get the Dread Knights into the Knights of the Realm. That is actually kind of a bad fight for us. That's alright. Pull you back a little bit. And pull you back a little bit. You're doing... Alright, but you are getting bombarded there. Fine. Let's send you guys over there to help. Because I don't think we need it over here anymore. Everything seems mostly dead. Except for these battle pilgrims who is not going to have a good time. Let's, let's just focus that. You guys shoot that. And we got executioners. So I think we're going to grab our black guards. We're going to send them up here to hold that. And I think they're going to be alright. We got some archers here. Well, we can probably kill that. Mostly. It's not bad. It's not great, but it wasn't bad. And how are you still fighting? I feel like you should be routing there, but no. Yeah, so you're breaking that. Let's, let's send you through to kill these peasants. That's gonna be fine. And did you honestly break through my dread spears? How'd you do that? That's pretty impressive. Yeah, you're dying. And you can keep going now. Because they have broken through over here. That's alright. Oh, and you can go and fight. And go in and fight with you as well. And yeah, just angle you here. This, this whole side is dead. We're good. You're broken, so the executioner will send into that blob. And I guess both of our... Oh, Dread Knights, actually. Let's send you, like, around here and start hitting those guys. Because the ex executioners can go and help out with that. You're kind of holding the line over there. We'll send you in here. That's gonna be fine. And our Black Guard can basically deal with most of that themselves. So line up there. Line up there. You're gonna hold that. Let's get more archers over there. And I think we can start just fast forwarding this. Because this is gonna be over here. And I would appreciate you not killing your own things. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Easy fight. Although the requesting knights did a number on our low terror infantry. Our elite infantry just slaughter them. And that's a lot of free money. I'll take it. 
This, however, I don't think we win. Oh well, that's alright. And that is gonna be problematic. <laughs> okay, Ratona is fighting back. That's fine. Oh, and the dwarves are fighting back. How is Altorf, by the way? I think we're gonna get some defenses here. Because I... What the hell? <laughs> what happened here? Alright, well, I want some defenses there. Just in case there is some dwarves trying to go and mess with our shit. But I think that's gonna be pretty good, especially with walls. And really slow dwarves. So I think we'll be fine there. Just keep marching, I guess. And we're pretty much good next turn. Now, problem is... You do reach us here. What kind of a garrison do we have here? You know what? I think we're alright if we just do it like this. It's gonna keep spending, but that's okay. That's gonna keep us safe, I think. Yeah, because that gives us the executioners and some other good stuff. And with a defense on the, with this guy, or if he just tries to attack this, but that's that's in March stance. I don't think he reaches us without March stance. So I think we're alright. And it seems like they're... They are gonna reinforce if they attack this guy, so I think we're good there. We are gonna be fine. So, Loki can keep going. Oh, and you can reach Castle Granset. Let's go in there. Excellent. And we'll just loot milk by this. And we're gonna get you off your chariot. Because I don't like chariot characters. I prefer a dark pegasus or a cold one. If we're gonna be like that. Oh, that's pretty good. Let's grab that too. And we can instead... Well, not instead. We can give you some good shit here. Kind of want to get to Indomitable, but... That's pretty good too. It's slowing down a little bit. He's really fast as is. So, 15 melee attack is really good. Speak. And you got that. I don't think we need that. So, I guess 5 armor isn't terrible. And I think we can just auto-level you now. And grab Blade Master. Nice. Weathers. And we might go and attack Aqua Teen next turn. A lot of stuff in there. But I want to... Mm, hello. You dishonor me, black-hearted dreadlord. Well, I can't move here thanks to you recruiting, so we can't go and murder you, which is a little bit annoying. But that's okay. As soon as we're done with recruiting this, we can go ham and just start murdering stuff. And it's gonna be great. But you shouldn't be that dangerous anymore, because we did kinda just ruin you there. And I guess Car Carcassonne is gonna rebel, but that is fine. We mostly just burnt it down, so let her rebel. Oh, they did attack here. Okay, I didn't expect it. They are giving us a pretty easy victory here, so <laughs> I'm just gonna take it. Sweet. And that's fine. We can go and murder them next turn. And they don't even take it, so that's fine. And Clan Septic wants a military alliance. You know what? We do have a lot of stuff with you and you're willing to pay for it, so I'll take it. It'll be fine. Might even get some rat stuff. Probably not, but we could. And they are sieging that. But we have an army moving in. I guess that's alright. We're gonna keep burning stuff and we'll kill stuff as we see it. What do you see? But I think we're going to trade a little bit of stuff here. So let's 
get all of these out of the way. And yeah, we can't trade with Sail you like you. that, but we can trade Supreme that way. Okay, so I think I want two of the cold one nights there. We'll give a Scourge Runner and the Flyers. And I think that's all right. I want to get a Black Arc instead of the Bleak Swords. The numbers are nice and the shields are nice. And I think they're a bit more defensive. They don't have as much armor. And you make better use of the... Yeah, I think I think this is going to be good. Let's just do it like that. And you can start murdering things again. And you can actually reach that, so... This is what you get for messing with my stuff. And yeah, that's that's fine. Black Can you take this? No, that's quite a big yes. garrison. Okay, we'll see. Back. We'll uh, just sail around the coast, see what we can get done. It's gonna be fine. Impossible. You're not gonna be able to take Altorf, I think. They're not fighting those guys. You are not fighting those guys. You need to start fighting people. Okay, you are fighting plenty of people. So I guess that's good. But we can finally start trading these back. So, yeah, we're pretty healthy. Give the healthy or the most elite ones. We'll give you guys... And I kind of want the Heldrake packs. So give these little lower tier ones. And we need to we need to unselect one thing. I think it might be one of these. The least good one of those is going to be fine, I think. Yeah. I think that's going to be what we do. That's uh, a good army. Oh, and we can definitely just go and take this. Dang it. Well, that's annoying. We could almost go and take that. All right. Well, let's move up and uh, let's recruit a couple of things. Oh, we can have another Creeping Dread. Didn't realize that. But let's grab a couple of these for this guy. That ought to be fine. Ooh, and we definitely want some of these. But we'll grab that. We'll finish those next turn. And let's go and take Castle Aquatine. I'm pretty sure that is... Uh, that that is a special map, so I kind of want to take it. And who am I looking for here? Who do we think have money? Ooh, Rakarth wants wants us to fight him. So yeah, let's be friends with Rakarth. That sounds great. Bow speak. So we'll uh, join your war against Bodolo. And in exchange, we'll be buds. Done. Nice. I like it. So I guess you're hanging out right there. Neat. But yeah, let's go and take Castle Aquatine. And that is quite the garrison. Oh, that is... That is tight. <laughs> it looks very cramped. All right, let's uh, go and have a look at Aquatine. So, what do you look like? Well, it is very cramped, as I expected. And where do we want to attack? They don't seem to have any towers here, which is kind of nice. This is very nice for archers, though. Just box them in and just shoot at them while they bust down the gate. But this is also a lot of space to climb. And I think we're all right climbing their shit here. I guess this could be good, too. We can probably climb this as well. Because we can definitely climb on this wall. Because our, our Corsairs are pretty jacked. So I think, yeah, we're going to go in and climb over there. You're group one. We're going to climb up on, on your wall. 
You, 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 and you are going to be a murder squad here, but none of you have have uh, Vanguard, so. And I think we're gonna chill with you. And I didn't realize you were that hurt. All right. And these guys are just gonna go up and shoot. So this is gonna be a little bit cramped for us too, but I think that's gonna be all right. So, start climbing. Uh, you guys go and bust down this gate. And I guess... Uh, oh, this is... Not a lot of room to... Set up our range stuff. Yeah, this might be... Might be a bad way to arrange our... Our stuff like that. Oh, hello. Um, we got a pit of doom... Oh, pit of shades things here for... Is taking out the men at arms and the blessed field field trebuchets. That's pretty nice. No and are they doing? Are they messing with me here? <laughs> They're bugging their gates open, so we can't attack it. That's shitty. Oh, okay. They actually let you in. I'm not sure if I want you to be inside though, so <laughs> let's just move around. And all of you, attack the gate, please. Now that it's closed again and we can actually attack it. It's so dumb. Uh, let's just flash that. We'll uh, see if we can cauldron view. And here's the... Yeah, now they're starting to do their thing. Let's see if we can soul rain on you. And you did not move. That was... <laughs> holy crap. Hell yeah. Well, good thing is uh, peasant bowmen don't do very good anti-armor, and we got pretty decent armor, so that's nice. And yeah, they moved out of, out of that at the very least, which makes sense. And I'm gonna make these guys feel bad. We're gonna pop in our slaves that we're sacrificing over there, and they'll just die on them. <laughs> that's just a very silly ability. And this seems to be taking a while. Oh, but you, you can fly, fly around and uh, deliver purple suns, and let's deliver that one right over there. So that can hit two of them. That's just gonna suck the souls out of these stupid peasants. Come on, there you go. That's gonna be some good shit. That's gonna shut them off. No more shooting for you, nerds. And we... I guess some of our stuff got inside. Well, in that case, let's... Uh... Oh, come on. Start doing some stuff over here. Now I wish I had some cooldowns there, but that is okay. So we can still get some soul blight if we wanted to. And... Okay. The guys who isn't inside, please smack the gate a little bit, so the rest of us can come. And you, actually, just focus on the gate. It'll be great. Oh, we got the dragon inside though, so smack him with the AOE. Beautiful. You're taking a lot of damage here. That's all right. Oh, and now you broke through. So everybody inside, and just get a big debuff on all of that. You can definitely start getting inside, so can probably you. So let's send you in over there. And that is probably a good place for that. Yeah, there's some good AoE. Excellent. And we got that back, so... Okay, you're gonna get shut down, so let's just purple sun you. And let's see if we can just uh, march these guys inside. Some of them use, will use ladders. It's fine. Let's get you inside too. Just make your way inside. I don't care how. As long as you get inside, I do not care. And let's get you in the air. Because I want to breathe on these guys. Because they made a beautiful little line for me. Perfect for breathing. That is a beautiful breath attack. 
<laughs> Holy crap. Send you in over there. Uh, I can view one of these foot squires. Send you in. Send you in. You're gonna do fine. Since you are a little bit hurt, but that is honestly fine. Send you in like so. You can go and kill there. And I think this is gonna be game pretty quickly here. Oh. Send you in over there. So you've been Bunad and you've been Corsaired, so you're gonna be pretty dead there. Oh, and are you gonna. You're gonna be a beautiful little blob here for me. Oh, let me. Let me drop my load on you. Ah, uh, it's gonna. Oh, nope. Oh, actually, it's not gonna miss. It's gonna be amazing, and that's gonna be our losses. Sweet. Also, this is a cool map. It's very tiny, but pretty all right. So they didn't exactly have very good ways of stopping me, but it was a cool map. I liked it. And ooh, that is a lot of money for <laughs> sacking that. And we still have a lot of movement. And I don't think I care about taking that, so I think we're moving on to Castle Brion. Probably. Oh, there's Rakarth. Hell yeah. Okay, then we're taking Castle Brion and we're selling it to Rakarth, and I think that's gonna be great. Um, we're probably, yeah, we're auto leveling you and we're auto leveling you, so that's gonna be fine. And I guess that was the same turn, so that's alright. And this is all the same turn, so we're good. We're just gonna pass the turn here. And Kemler wants an aggression pact. I mean, at this point, I don't think we're gonna fight him, so might as well. And I don't think we're gonna win that, so... Oh! There's the Fane Chatteris. Well, we're not winning that, so that's alright. Oh, hello. Um, you're all right. <laughs> that wasn't very thought through. And I'm gonna take my replenishment there. And there goes the rebellion. That's all right. We do not need that. And there's a lot of rebellions happening here. All right. I mean, we don't really care about any of those high elf rebels, though. We only have one guy there. Okay. I wasn't expecting high elf rebels. All right. Um, well, in that case, we're gonna go and take that back. That's fine. Um, loot and occupy it. How dare the elves come come over here and think they can do stuff to me? I don't think so. And. Uh, Can we take this? Probably, right? Yeah, that's fine. We, make them bleed. Bring me we can just re-recruit some of those. That's fine. And we've got a bunch of things back, which is neat. But I don't think it matters. And uh, do we want anything? I don't think so. I mostly just want this to grow. So for now, keep grabbing those. We're gonna heal that pretty quick. And this shouldn't really do anything against us. We're a little bit hurt, but not hurt enough for them to take us on. Lots of stuff just gathering over there. And uh, I guess what we could do is uh, put a blockade there and we'll use you to go and take it. Yeah, and I think most of the damage is not only on you. Okay, that's fine. So, let's not occupy that. And you can just keep on moving. Because I figured these have both fallen. We did get to keep Brookwater, and we do hold most of this, this uh, coast. But I think, yeah, I think we're gonna go and take these back. We can go down to Kemperbad afterwards and just 
go up and down the the what you call it the uh, the river and just have a good time with you I did level a lot and just keep grabbing line breakers what is these stats now 76 40 78 <laughs> oh that is just nuts same with you like 58 39 78 and then 63 missile strength that is insane like that is absolutely ridiculous who thought this was a good idea? <laughs> um, let's give you sadistic. It's kind of nice. And we'll make her. And honestly, it doesn't matter that much what you guys level. So I think we're just going to start giving these guys auto leveling. Let's give you more melee attack though. And uh, this is not the same turn, so let's go to Castle Brion, and then we'll just go up the coast, I think. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, we're gonna loot and occupy this. Ooh, Blades of the Blood Queen is sweet. And uh, just go into a camp stance, and then we're gonna sell some stuff with you. Or to you, I suppose, is the right way to say things. <laughs> so, we're gonna give you Castle Brion and Ferignac. Oh, we can only do one at a time and they don't want Ferignac. Well, Castle Brion then. Yeah, that you really want. So grab all the good stuff with you and 15,000. Hell yeah! That's a good haul. Okay, you know so... I am. Oh. Is that all of your money? Or can we sell Castle Grassnet as well? Nope, oh, that was all of your money. That's alright. That is pretty... Oh, and we got the Claw of the Ebonheart. Sweet. But we can keep selling these guys. And yeah, okay. I I think I see why they didn't want it. It's uh, in ruins. And it's plagued. So... <laughs> I can see that. And we should reach that next turn. That's gonna be nice. Sorceress. You already moved. We took that this turn. And we have moved you this turn. Good. So... Oh, we can grab this. Uh, we're gonna grab that next turn. Just to keep that buff up as long as possible. So... Oh, and you need control and control probably. I guess we don't need all of these, so let's uh, let's just demolish this one for defenses instead. And Dudan, <laughs> it's a silly name. Oh shit! There's something Ariel at just Laguilaire. It's all right. And oh, they're trying to take our now, but our defenses here is pretty good. So oh <laughs> shit. Yeah, we're gonna lose a lot, but uh, we're gonna kill all of them. So let's just take a little bit of replenishment if we can. And we have a lot of money all of a sudden. So... Oh, did they always... Yeah, they always had Karaburg, but I think they might lose it here. So that's alright. We're gonna just continue on to Scheinfeld. Wait, uh, dang it. I was gonna do the same. Time for the base, but I don't remember it. It was just gonna go do 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 do. <laughs> that is just wrong. Uh, oh yeah, I, I can't remember it. I don't know why. Um, right, we do have a black arc over here. We should probably just get a couple of corsairs just to defend it and maybe go to Fort Solis soon. That is fine and. Uh, Ooh, we can get some shades there. Yeah, let's get some dual-wielding shades. We can just be fine with that. And then maybe start going north. Oh, hello. Okay, we're gonna do that. I didn't realize we were under siege here. But let's repair that. And I think I kind of want some defenses there. We do have a growth. Three turns, we'll have two. And we can get... A garrison there, I think. Because I kind of want it. 
And let's go and take... Oh, hello. Look at the stuff in there. Oh, shit. They got a lot of stuff in there. That's gonna be a garrison, I'm pretty sure. Oh, and there's Albrecht. Oh, I hate this one. Okay, well, that's fine. I think, um, I guess we're gonna finish this episode by killing Alberic. Let's give you that, though. There we go. Alright, so I think we're just gonna try to make them blob up real nice and use our amazing... Oh, shit, I didn't do the... Do the right. But yeah, we're gonna rely on some of our amazing AoE stuff here. So let's... Send them in like that. Ah, you can all be group one. And we'll send... Just Loki here, I think. And this guy. Actually, no, that's gonna go on the other side. One Sea Dragon each. Grab some Helldrakes. And... Uh, I think that's gonna be what we send. You can fly around pretty much wherever. And we're just gonna fight on these lines, kinda. So I think that's gonna be alright. And luckily, we... We get there right away. So we don't have to walk up to it. So you'll be group one. And they do have Pegasus Knights. You might be able to take out Pegasus Knights. And we can lock him down. Yeah, it's fine. I'm a little bit worried that they'll kill you, so honestly, just put you on the ground. Because I feel like you might be safer on the ground. And you'll be in group two. So, move you up. Move you up. And move you up. And send you in. That is a lot of stuff. That is a lot of stuff. Like, a lot of stuff. Alright, let's see how this goes. You're already pretty hurt. Um, oh, I guess we can keep you up there. Here comes the Pegasus. Well, they are landing over here, so... Alright, let's... Time down. We'll lash him a little bit. Pop that, and... Um, just get the hell in there. Go in and fight. How are we doing over here? We're doing fine. Let's get in there and fight. And honestly... Oh, that is so blobby. Let's just drop a big one over there. And cut them. Just get in there. Land. You can go and breathe on that though. Did we hit? Yeah, we definitely killed one of those. That's pretty nice, actually. Let's get a soul rain. Oh, shit, that is big. Holy crap, that is big. All right, well, let's go and hit them. Let's go and land inside of some of that. We need to... Oh, yeah, that is, that is really big. Let's explode them as well while we're at it. Got a lash of cane to do right there. And did we explode with you? No, we didn't, but we are chasing things off. Um, Alright, that's fine. You should probably just do a big soul blight right there. We should bolt those knights of the realm, probably. Oh, shit. Ah, oh, dang it. Get my dragon out of there. Oh, uh, we might lose the dragon here. Um, let's get a... Let's just get it over there, actually. I think that's fine. And, okay, send Loki here in there. We're gonna do the breath attack. Pop his things, lock some stuff down. That's fine. You're not fighting anything. I don't like that. You're, that's the opposite of what you're supposed to do, be doing. Oh, and you, you need to get out of there. You're gonna die, and I don't want you to die. You seem to be stuck in combat as well, which I also do not like. But let's flash some things, tie them down. It's gonna be good. You don't have a breath yet. 
please pull through. I don't want you to be killed. You're shattered. Excellent. And that is just a big blob right there. Let's send some Corsairs after that. You need to go and fight stuff. You don't have a breath yet. Do we have any other AoE here? I feel like I didn't send enough AoE here. That's alright. We have Loke here. He's gonna do fine. You almost have a breath again. Just stay on top of you, I guess. Keep at that. Stop trying to murder him. Oh, shit. We have, we have the Pit of Shades thing right there. That's gonna be huge. And we got a Web of Shadows that we can just pop. Oh, I completely forgot about all of your things. You got so many good things. Explode. Thank you. Get, go into those men at arms. Uh, get another one of those. Just get that debuff going. And I think I want to buna some horses here. Well, they are do taking a lot of damage, but yeah. These knights of the realm can probably go and fight it somewhere. I think that's pretty good. They're doing fine. Let's go and hunt those down. Uh, you're fine. Let's send you up to fight something. Go and murder. You might just dodge that, but I would like for you to just die for free if we could. That would be great. And where's... I think... Oh, he... He didn't dodge it. Why are they so shit at dodging all of a sudden? They always dodge shit, usually. Yeah, lock him down. I want to kill these guys. Oh, did we, did we lock down the wrong thing? Alright. Well, that seems a lot like army losses. We just need to kill... You. What else is not running? You're running, you're running. Is there any more pilgrims? I don't think so. There's some stuff over there, but I think we are just gonna run until we kill these guys. So that was pretty good. Man, the sea dragon is so good though. <laughs> it killed so many things. I guess this one would have killed a lot too if we didn't start at like 25% health. Man, sometimes you wish you had a life cast, you know? Uh, yeah, we're just gonna loot and occupy this. Try to recover a little bit. Most of them are gonna recover pretty much all the way, except for our dragons, which is a little bit unfortunate. But I think I'm gonna end this episode here. Next turn and next episode, we're gonna go for Castle Bordelow, which also has a special map, so I think that's gonna be pretty neat. And let's actually see if you want... This one needs either well do you want the plagued ruins which is raided by skaven or do you want a nice peaceful little place let's see uh, it is ferignac which you do seem to want otherwise we can do castle grand grand set and they will pay more for it but i think i rather just uh, Give him this because it's kind of shit and it's uh, not going to get any better than that. <laughs> so yeah, so be let's it. sell that to him. And I don't mind uh, Rakarth being stronger. So, I like it. Uh, is it you can just also sit and chill there. And we'll start moving you over. Should we send you to Corona and start... Bopping these. We can go down this way That, in that case. Yeah, let's go and sit you in Corone and... Oh, we can actually reach that. Probably should have reached that. But I think we... Yeah, we get to kill that. Sweet. So, take the money. And start moving down. We should reach that next turn. And that's not going to be a problem. Oh, right, uh, I was going to end this episode there, but I got distracted. But yeah, I'm going to end this episode here. I think next episode might be the last one, because I feel like we're just running around murdering things for the, for the kicks of it. But we're going to keep going down the coast, keep murdering stuff, get our last map. And, uh, oh, there's a little, little neat little island there.
And uh, just keep burning Corone. They don't have a lot, a lot of stuff left. We might be able to just kill them next turn. Because if we just go down here, murder this, and go through here and take Klesen back, I think that's pretty much all they have. Yeah, neat. But yeah, we. Oh, also before I. <laughs> God damn it. I keep being sidetracked. But I am gonna end the episode here, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.